I got married to my wife in 1994, precisely the month of August. And um, the expectation of uh, the two partners in the relationship is to bring forth babies. Our situation was so pathetic that we have to wait for over 20 years to be called mommy and daddy in the house. So we went to several hospitals. Results confirm, confirm that we are perfectly okay medically. And we even tried local way and they too still confirm the same thing. So at that point in time, we knew that something is wrong spiritually. We came face to face with all sorts of mockery and all manner of name calling from the society and from our own family. Sincerely, despite all what we passed through, we were steadfast. We were not discouraged on account of not bringing forth babies. We were not discouraged. In 2010, we joined this commission and we started engaging in kingdom advancement endeavor by winning souls to the kingdom, visiting motherless babies' home, reaching out to the less privileged by providing shelter and their upkeep in our own little ways. And kingdom advancement prayer become our routine. By so doing, the God of this great commission showed up and blessed us with a set of twins, a boy and a girl. After giving birth to this first set of twins, the new week of delay conception began. And my wife, sincerely, at that point, she, she actually gave up to God alone. She, all her, her mind, she believed that with God, all things are possible. In 2020, um, my wife started having uh, these signs of pregnancy, started throwing up, started having a headache, and sometimes um, she used to have this dizziness and all of that. All the signs of women being pregnant were experienced by her. So with those strange feelings, I went to the hospital for scan, and scan confirmed I'm not pregnant, but my tummy is still getting bigger and I'm still getting the feeling of a pregnant woman. We now consulted the, a massager, all these uh, local uh, midwives that massages pregnant women. So when we massage, when they massage my wife, the midwife confirmed that my wife was pregnant. At some point I went to the hospital and their scan, scan confirmed the womb is large, but there is no baby in the womb. Throughout that period, I was having this serious waist pain, which couldn't allow me to do anything. I invited um, a nurse, a medical practitioner, to intervene. She was taking care of her, giving her, was carrying out some preliminary tests. And um, our test also shows that my wife, she confirmed that my wife was pregnant. So it, was, it comes to a time where the water even burst and be gushing out. I now called for my nurse. She now came and said it's time for delivery. That was when I was taken to the favor room and I now deliver. The God of this commission embarrassed us with sex to plates, two boys and four girls. And this experience is first of its kind in my state, Bayasa state, and in my local government, South Anijo, and my community, Kulama. And my immediate family, the family of Wilson, and my family of living faith. So I've come back to return all the glory back to the God of this great commission who has done everything perfectly for me, for making me to be a mother of children and for the perfect delivery, peaceful delivery 
Indeed, Matthew 6, 33 was clearly seen. Jesus is Lord. <laughs>